In this video, we'll talk you through the programming of the Yale Assure SL and the Yale Assure Lock. We'll be demonstrating with the Assure Lock, but the programming is the same for the Assure SL. First, you will need to set your master PIN code. This code controls every other feature of your digital door lock. Touch the screen to activate, then press 1 to register a master code, followed by the gear key. Now, enter a unique 4 to 8 digit master PIN code, followed by the gear key. Touch the keypad for the lock to work out the handing. Handing lock completed. First, enter your master code followed by the gear key. Menu now press 2 followed by the gear key. Now press 1 followed by the gear key. Then, enter a unique 4 to 8 digit PIN code, followed by the gear key. Press the gear key to program more codes, or press the tick key to end your programming session. Completed. Touch the keypad with the palm of your hand. Enter your user PIN, followed by the tick key. Enter your master PIN code, followed by the gear key. Press 2, followed by the gear key. Press 3, followed by the gear key. Now, enter the PIN code that you want to delete, followed by the gear key. Now, press the gear key to delete more codes, or press the tick key to end your programming session. The automatic relock default setting is disabled. To change this setting, enter your master PIN code followed by the gear key. Press 3 and then the gear key to enter advanced mode. Press 1 and then the gear key. Then choose your automatic relocking setting. And then the gear key. Press the tick key to complete. The inside indicator light is located on the interior assembly and shows the active status of the lock. When illuminated, this indicates the door is locked. To enable the inside indicator light, enter your master PIN code and press the gear key. Press 3, then the gear key to enter advanced mode. Press 2, and then the gear key, followed by 1 to enable the indicator light. Then press the gear key. Press the tick key to complete. Privacy mode is disabled by default. Enter privacy mode by pressing the privacy button for 4 seconds to put the lock into do not disturb mode. All PIN codes will be disabled in privacy mode. The default volume setting is low. To change the volume setting, enter your master PIN code, then press the gear key. Press 4 and then the gear key. Then choose between the settings high, low or silent. And press the gear key. Press the tick key to complete. When the lock is reset to factory defaults, all user codes, including the master PIN code, are deleted and all programming features are reset to the original default settings. Remove the battery cover and batteries. Remove the internal assembly to access the reset button. The reset button is located beside the cable connector. 
then pressing the reset button for at least 3 seconds. Secure the internal assembly to the mounting plate. Reinstall the batteries. Replace the battery cover and gently tighten the screw. While registering PIN codes, be sure to keep the door open so you don't lock yourself out. Only clean your digital lock with mild detergent and water. Do not use any solvents or abrasive cleaners as this may damage the lock.